Hello, it's Helder here, and today I want to talk to you about this new kit that I picked up, first aid kit, by My Medic. I have been seeing My Medic advertise uh, for the last couple years all around social media, and uh, what piqued my curiosity is that they have been combining with some very credible organizations where these organizations are making My Medic basically their go to uh, first aid kit. So, of course, that piqued my curiosity and i wanted to uh, put it through my review process and i was fortunate enough to have my medic send me one of their recon units and i want to get into a bit of detail on why i feel that the my medic first aid kits are certainly a cut above the rest so let's get into it now i have reviewed a lot of combat casualty kits and first aid kits over the years and uh, they are certainly not all created equally there is a plethora of first aid kits out there and people are interested in them because of the low price points and the fact that they come bundled with tons and tons of stuff. Well, the issue with that is they could come bundled with a bunch of stuff, but if the stuff that's in there is crap and is useless and you need to rely on that one day to, let's say, provide first aid for a loved one and you reach into your pack and you pull out a bunch of useless uh, junk and can't go ahead and provide this uh, care to your loved ones that's when the issues arise and that's why we are discussing this now so that that hopefully never happens to you so what is it about my medic that makes them so different than everybody else first off the first thing that i notice is the thought that was put into design uh not only is the pack itself super rugged and built the way that uh i would want it built as far as being able to access all the compartments, the way that the compartments were, were placed, the ease of being able to get to the actual content, especially when there's a scenario and your heart is beating outside your chest, you need to get in there and you need to get in there quickly and access the contents that you actually need. So the design of this pack, the way that it was put together, that in itself is something that had me sold right from the beginning. The other thing, of course, is the contents themselves, the quality of the contents themselves. So I'm not going to go and list all the different quality or contents that uh, this kit contains because I would turn this review and add another 10 minutes to this review where I could just go ahead and list all of those uh, components on my blog post. So make sure you go ahead and check out the blog post. This kit here is actually known as the Recon Kit and it's a medium sized kit offered by my medic. Now this is the medium kit, obviously there are much bigger kits, there are boat kits, there are trauma kits, there are all sorts of kits depending on your needs and of course much smaller solo type kits also if that is something that you are in the market for. Um, now speaking specifically about this recon kit, it offers seven different compartments on this quality durable 600D bag. So uh, I kind of already went over that a little bit earlier. There are concealed pockets. So anything that you might want to have for your EDC, you have a nice shoulder strap here. You have uh, three different D-links or uh, D-rings to be able to uh, hang or um, hook up your pack, depending once again on the conf configuration that you're looking for. Uh, there are obviously the panels here for various uh, patches and it comes with the MyMedic patch itself. And there are also three extra accessory components here on the side that are easily easy to remove um, using one of them let's say for my EpiPen, uh, another one you can store your flashlight in here on the side here i did add a tourniquet and uh, i want you to also keep in mind that there are two basically two levels that each one of these kits by my, my medica uh, come with and none of them come with the cat now what i was trying to say before uh, marley rudely interrupted my video here was that there are two options that all of these uh, kits by my Meta come with. They have a basic contents version, and then they have a beefier version with basically more contents that they call the advanced contents version. Obviously, there is a difference in price points, the advanced version being much more expensive, so make sure that you check the contents. If you have uh, certain tourniquets and other things laying around, you might not need to double up and be able to get away with the basic version, saving you some money. One quick note that I wanted to go over is just like anything that you would have in your EDC or in your everyday carry, you need to get familiar with the contents of your kits. You need to know where everything is, whether it's in the dark, uh, whatever scenarios, because most of the time when you're going to need these kits, it's not going to be in a nice, calm situation, of course, unless you're teaching or demonstrating or something like that. 
but in all applications if you are going to provide first aid it's not going to be a comfortable situation and the less familiar that you are of where your contents are where you keep them that's just going to inhibit your performance and your effectiveness of being able to provide first aid the other thing is training doesn't matter how expensive your kit is or how many bells and whistles or how cool or tactical cool it looks if you are not trained in using and providing these uh, items uh, as effective first aid then uh, the whole point of this is moot it's pretty useless and uh, the only thing that I could really really uh, convey to you right now is get your training not only get familiar with what you're carrying but know how to use it so bottom line if you're in the market for a quality, durable first aid kit that comes with a lifetime warranty, has uh, a container or contained in a pack that uh, you'd be rivaled to find something to match the quality of the pack itself, take a look at these uh, kits by my medic. I'm a fan of them. My family's a fan of them. My cat is a fan of them. And I'm sure if you pick one up, you'll be a fan too. Once again, this is Helder. I hope that you found this review helpful.